Okay, that's uh that's another game. Okay. So um uh, Alex forty two. Ah, uh, Alga. Okay, let's stop observing. Uh, maybe uh Slav set up to be solid. Try and play solid. Aggressive. Can I get a sort of Dutch transposition? I think knight e4, that could be fun. But f5. <laughs> I'm controlling e5 at the moment. Don't know about a4, looks a bit suspect. He's not going to be able to uh, exchange off dark square bishops that easily, I think. Uh, do I play a6 or not bother? Just queen f6 or g5. Uh, g5 at f4. I think a6, I don't know. Um, queen f6 looks. Sort of like a routine attack for g5 and f4, potentially. Uh, there's always f3 coming up. Uh, I can take on c3. Uh, then play f4. Squashes this bishop a little bit. Hmm. Ah, he's giving me this bishop to work with, I think, on this diagonal. Okay, that bishop not, not looking too hot. Um, take the bishop f4. Play e4 otherwise, maybe that's a good idea. And clamp down. Uh, I'm gonna get this knight out of the way, I think. Um, so I can play uh, knight f8. Okay, I'll go back here for a sec. I'm playing knight f8 and then. Ah! <laughs> Alright, I can double this pawn to whatever that's worth. Or bishop f4. Bishop f4 keeps that bishop locked down. Okay, let's go back here. Mind you, when I move the knight, there's knight e5 now. So is this that good? Hmm. Okay, provoking him forward soon. If I play knight g6, what is he going to do? Maybe I can get knight h4 in. Ah, oh, there's that pawn. Good point. <laughs> Mind you, bishop g4 could be a threat now if queen a7. Okay, so I'll get this knight in. So knight h4. I've got some play, I think. Try and get on to the uh, attack. Maybe bishop g4 is coming up, or knight g2 first, bishop g4. Check here, king g7. I think bishop g4 is on the cards. Must be. Bishop g4 is again on the cards. I'm controlling e7, of course, here. So bishop g4 must go for it. <laughs> I think f3 of rook e2. f3, rook f2. 
Hmm. Actually, rookie two, I just take. Oh, <laughs> okay. That's queen. Queen d one's dangerous. Doubling rooks. F three is dangerous. I'll go maybe F three first. And take and queen d one. That looks mega crush. Because I'm winning the queen. Queen d one. Winning the queen. Um. Can't take on h five. I'll just win the queen here. Right. Okay. I'll defend my back row for a moment. Hmm. Oh, the clock stops. Whoops. Am I still connected? Oh no, don't tell me. <laughs> oh, I've just been disconnected. Oh, don't tell me. Oh no. Oh no, I'm still connected. Whoops. <laughs> oh. Alright, so, uh. Oh, this could be tricky. If I kick that, just to try and play. Queen h5, it goes back to e5. Queen f3 then. So that gives me Queen f4. Or a check. I check here, looks dangerous. Rook f2 of king h2, or rook f4, rook g4, and queen h1. I think it's all over. So rook and no, rook g8 here looks good, or rook f3, king h2, and queen h1. If king g3, rook g8. If otherwise, yeah, I think queen h1. Okay, yeah, interesting uh, touch game uh, transposition. Yeah, so I had. Um, I think I might be in trouble actually. I think. Uh, because of E5 control. But anyway, I think, yeah, maybe taking that pawn was, was a mistake. That's king side onslaught. Uh, okay, comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.